Have you been searching for name painting brushes but you found absolutely nothing out there? Well in this video I will be showing you how to make your own brushes, so let's get right to it. Hey guys, thank you for being here. My name is Marisol and this is Art Heals You, helping you expand your creativity and use painting as a self-care tool. And in this channel, I will be doing painting tutorials as well as painting tips and some art product reviews. So if you are new here, please consider subscribing. So if you have been interested in this technique and you've been thinking about learning it, you may have found that it has been difficult to find paint brushes. I totally get where you are coming from. In fact, when I got started, I had such a hard time finding these brushes, it became a little overwhelming. But the good news is that I did find a way to make them myself. So today I will be teaching you how to make your own brushes. So let's get right to it. Okay, so first things first, let's go over the tools that you will be needing in order to create your own brushes. So the tools that you will need are a chop saw or a grinder will work too, a bench grinder, a vise, sandpaper, and also some aluminum or stainless steel flat strips. And lastly, you will need your safety gear. So the first thing you wanna do is get your aluminum or stainless steel strips. I suggest going to your local hardware store where you will find a variety. The strips will vary in length, anywhere from 12 inches to 48 inches. Any length will work, so you don't really have to worry about that. The width that I use is 3 quarters of an inch. As far as the thickness, be sure that the thickness is anywhere from 0.025 through 0.032 inches. Or if you want them a little thicker, you can also get 0.06 to 5 inches in thickness. But really, to be honest, I suggest anything between 0.025 through 0.032 just to make it easier to work with. So the next thing that you will want to do is you are going to want to measure and mark your lines where you will be cutting the strip. So my brushes are 4 inches in length and that's what I will be showing you guys, right? So again, if you want them to be a little longer, you can do 5 inches, it's really up to you. But my brushes are 4 inches so I will be sticking with that measurement for today. So what you want to do is you want to lay your strip on a table and you want to go ahead and grab a sharpie and a ruler. Next what you're going to do is you're going to mark your measurements and you're going to be making your markings every 4 inches. I have cut all the strips and also used the table grinder to clean off the edges. So if you can see, I rounded off the edges slightly, not too much. You just want them slightly rounded or you can make them more round if you want. But if I touch the edges, you can feel that they are still going to be a little rough. So now at this point, what you want to do is you want to grab some sanding paper and sand off those edges.
Now that we have gone over the art materials and the paint brushes, in the next videos I will be showing you how to paint letter brush art. If you are getting value from this video, please let me know by hitting that like button. And also, if you have any questions for me, just let me know down in the comments below and I will be sure to get back to you soon. If you are interested in learning more about this skill, I am in the process of building an online course. So all you have to do now is go to the description below, click on lovely name paintings and go ahead and sign up for the online course. And I will be sure to keep you posted of the date of when I launch. And if you are interested in these brushes, now you have two options. One, you can make the brushes yourself as I showed you in this video, or two, now I have a full set of brushes available to you. So all you have to do now is go to the description below to get your full set of brushes. I hope this video has been helpful in helping you make your own brushes. Until then, stay creative and I'll be seeing you soon.